Okay, this is American Contractor with another video. Russian Special Forces arrive in southern Syria after U.S. airstrike on the Army convoy. On May 18th, I just want to let you know that, that the U.S.-led coalition forces uh, engaged the uh, pro-Assad militia forces that were engaging, uh, were getting close to the uh, Al Tanif uh, fire base there with the U.S. forces and the British forces. They were warned. Of, they, the U.S. warned them multiple times. They went. They went to uh, move their position back away from the Al Tanif base. So they struck them with engaging with weapons. After that happened, the Russian special forces arrived in the country, which is a good thing, I guess. Uh, a military source confirmed that a group of Russian paratroopers and special forces have arrived in the southern province of Sweden after the U.S.-led coalition fighters jets targeted heavily military convoy of the pro-Syrian government forces near the town of al Tanif at the border with Iraq. So when the attack happens, the Russians responded with, we're going to put in some special forces, which is good. Um, I think they're just wasting their time because they're not going to defend anything, in my opinion. Uh, they're just going to stand back and let things happen. But they're trying to protect the, uh, the U.S.-led coalition. is trying to protect the uh, southeast region of the Iraqi Syrian border and including down south more towards Jordan and Syria border. So they're just trying to protect those areas and uh, we're going to see what happens. But things are ramping up here in the Syrian conflict, which I think this is going to start blowing up here shortly. Uh, thank you for watching. Give me a thumbs up, make some comments below, and subscribe to the channel if you have not. Subscribe to the channel. Thank you.